to my YouTube channel. So this is the Alpha Trade. Today I'm going to share with you guys a very powerful strategy. How you combine your price action with two indicators to make massive profits on the market. Okay, so um, this strategy I'm not giving it to you free of charge. If you are watching this video now, you owe me a hundred dollars. But I'm not charging you right now. Okay, so I'm giving this strategy on credit so that when you make money with it, you come back and pay me my hundred dollars. Do you know why I'm doing that? I'm doing it because I believe that surely you are going to make money with this strategy. So I'm not going to charge you now. I'm going to give you this on credit based on trust. So when you make money with it, you come back and give me hundred dollars. I believe you will come back because definitely you're going to make money with this strategy. So stick with me. Let me show you how it goes. All right, so um, the first thing you do when you open your chart like this is to switch over to your one hour time frame, okay? Your H1 time frame. So you see, we are on the H1 time frame right now. So after that, the next thing you want to do is to draw your support and your resistance, okay? Basically, the high point and the lowest point support and your resistance after you do that the next thing you want to do is to switch over to your 15 minutes time frame when you switch over to your 15 minutes time frame you want to begin to look out for market structure okay so here you can see our support and resistance level as we marked out earlier here's our support so here's our resistance and here's our support as earlier indicated now you can see the market structure price was making lower low here making low here like breaking of structure here breaking of another structure here and it came to the um support level after you get that then you want to see price break structure to the to the um upside which is a change of character change of character right so with that you know that price has changed direction some call it shift in market structure once you see that the next thing you want to do is to introduce your indicator you come to this place where you see this F here that's where you get your indicator and when you come there you look for this very indicator called the moving average cross right so we introduce it to your chart they call it um the ma slash ema moving average chart this is it here you can see so that's what i want so you are going to take i'm going to show you guys the setting along the line okay then the next thing you want to do is to also come here take another indicator called the stock moving average this is it here the stock moving average this is it okay now i'm also going to show the settings along the line what you're going to do after you have set it is this remember we've seen a change of character at this point we've gotten a change of character at this point so obviously we are now in an uptrend okay so i want to get it yeah so what we are going to do is you want to be joining you want to be um taking this trade at a pullback okay you want to be taking this trade joining joining it at the 
retracement area all right you want to join it at the end of each of these retracements as we already know that price moves in waves so it gives you a move like this a push and then it gives you a discount like this and then impulsive move again and a discount like this so that is what the market does so for that reason we want to be taking advantage of the discount part of the market okay, so when you trace it like this as soon as the tracement is over you are able to take your trade as this retracement is happening here as soon as it's over we are able to join the buy that's what we want to be doing here because price is coming from what the support level but assuming it's coming from the resistance here we want to be taking the sales right we want to be taking sales only so that's how this works and the reason we already already um an advantage of this is that for the fact that it's coming from um support level that means we already know the trend we've seen the chalk here so we already know the trend we are trading in line with the trend they're not trading against the trend so this is going to be very easy for you to make profits on the long run okay so the strategy works on boom and crash also okay and this is actually the strategy i use to make money from the market and i teach this more in depth in my vip uh, mentorship classes so if you want to join my mentorship class this for this october feel free to register with me immediately my telegram link is in the description box click the link and join me right away okay click the link and join my telegram i share um i share um what do you call it i share chat setup and signals every day so you are going to be trading my signals and chat setups on daily basis free of charge i also have a vip mentorship class i have a vip um, signal group also so have robots and um, indicators so anyone you want let me know just join our telegram group okay so um let's continue with this so now that we have gotten um now that we've gotten this gotten to this point what we want to do is we've gotten a um, change of character so as soon as we see retracement like this as soon as we see price making a retracement like this okay so you don't put your um you don't put the indicator yet okay so we don't need the indicator yet we are still going to be dealing with our naked chart we don't need the indicator yet sorry for bringing it earlier so as soon as we see the change of character like this the next thing we want to look out for is retracement right as this retracement begins to happen what we are going to do is we go to um our five minutes time frame before i go there i want to bring this down i want to bring this stuff so that i'll mark this our retracement area because we are simply back testing we are back testing so let me mark this our retracement area right okay so i've marked it this our retracement area here and that's what you normally do so after you've marked it like this what you want to do is to go down to your five minutes time frame okay so we are going to add five minutes time frame then on this five minutes time frame what you are going to be doing is you are going to be trading the moving average crossover like this okay so this is it so i'm not going to bring in my indicator right so here i can introduce the indicator good i've introduced it then i also introduced the other one here so the moving average cross and the stochastic rsi moving average cross and the stochastic rsi now what do you need to see before you take your trade 
is very simple now the stochastic rsi if you check you're going to see this bar here you're going to see this bar here that is your point of interest okay so once the indicator remember this our retracement here okay so the first thing you want to see is that this indicator crosses the bar right crosses above it and remember we are taking only buys because price is coming from our support level so we are taking only buys so as soon as the indicator crosses um that is the stochastic rsi as soon as the orange line crosses the bar here the next thing you want to see is for this indicator to show you this cross here okay if we show you this cross you're going to see this kind of sign which means crossover all right so you're going to see it i think the sign is like this yeah it's like a cross like this so you see it here as soon as you see it, that's where you do what that's where you buy so as soon as you see it you're going to place your trade and you're going to take one is to two risk reward ratio that's a minimum you're going to be taking okay you're going to target one is to two so as soon as you place the trade here um you're going to bring your yeah you're going to set your stop loss below the um you're going to stop set your stop loss below your entry candle all right below the signal candle that's where you're going to be setting your stop loss below it not exactly on the signal candle don't misunderstand me you're going to set it below it not exactly on it so this is it we have it below and then target one is to two risk reward ratio as a minimum you can target higher but the minimum you, can, you should target is one is to two as you can see here we got one is to three we got one and one is to three okay you can see we met our tp right away it's as simple as that we met our tp here very easily now if you go back to the 15 minutes time frame again we are going to look for another retracement and we are going to uh, shoot our shots again so this under retracement price retraced again this is the first one we entered we hit our tp then price retraced again okay so price retraced again and this is it so let's mark it and go back to the back test. this i'm doing now is back testing guys and remember this strategy works both boom and crash step index so we'll go back to our five minutes time frame again during this retracement so this strategy works both for step index oh shit. it works for jump index it works for boom and crash and the rest of them so this is it we mark our retracement here then we now go back to our five minutes time frame so on our five minutes time frame you know what we are looking for we want to see the crossovers okay so this is it on our five minutes time frame we want to see this crossover as usual we want to see the stochastic rsi crossing over right they want to see our exponential moving average showing us this cross here also remember this is cross below so we are not taking it we are not selling we are looking for buys only okay so this is not a signal for us at all even at this point this one was still crossing below so it's not a signal for us at all so discard it where we are taking is the buy signal so here we take our trade and we still target our one is to um one is to two or one is to three risk reward ratio so this is the signal candle here take your trade place your stop loss below it remember i said below not on it i said below it so 
you must always remember that your stop loss is going below it, not above it. Oh shit, this one is messy. Okay, so this is it. Okay, let me get it right. Good. Then you target one is to two. This one is to two here. This one is to two or one is to three. Anyhow you want it. For minimum is one is to two. That's what I'm trying to say. Minimum target is one is to two. You can go higher. Like for instance, if you wanted to go higher here, you could have also gotten even as much as this. You could have gotten even as much as um you know but it will make us wait long anyways. But we would have gotten as much as one is to ten risk reward ratio. See that over one is to ten or even one is to one is to eleven risk reward ratio. You can see that. We have gotten it. Look at it here. Risk reward ratio. Look at it here. We have gotten about 1 is to 11, but that's not what we want. We want to just take quickly a scalping. So you go for your 1 is to 2 as minimum. Risk reward ratio. Okay. So this strategy works 100%. Almost 100%. Almost 100%. But we don't like to say 100%, so I'm just gonna say 99%. <laughs> okay, so let me let me give you one more example. Let me give you one more example. So I'm going back to 15 minutes time frame. Just take note of how I'm doing these guys. Take note of how I'm doing these guys. Okay, so um, we've got another retracement here. Price got here and started retracing again. Okay, so started retracing again. So we've got this retracement again price got here and then started retracing so this is where we got our retracements down here so let's just keep it let's check it and see what happened there okay so this is it uh, so I placed my two there place my two here so I scale down to the five minutes time frame down to the five minutes time frame let's see what is happening guys this is how you're gonna make the market till you, you get to um till you get to your resistance level remember we are moving from the support level okay so this is it you can see this is where um this is where the stuff is and we didn't get any signal we didn't get any signal so we are not taking any trade but at this point give us this signal here but this one didn't give us any signal so we are taking no trade okay then at this point we got the this one gave us signal here this also gave us signal here. so this is where we are taking the trade do you see that guys take notes of this please remember this follow these rules and i assure you you are going to be making a lot of profits from this market it's very simple the problem of most of you is that you don't follow instructions that's the problem of most of you but if you follow instructions believe me you're gonna make a lot of money from this it's stupidly simple okay so let me show you this let's see um after i've gotten our signal so you're gonna take the trade right here okay and then our um, stop loss is coming below our entry signal here so we are gonna take this up here this already um over one is to two right it's more than one is to two already like it's more than one is to two already but let's take it up to the end so following our one is to two um target would have met our tip already so but this one is to three so we'd have also hit our tip very like very very simple and it's just in one two it's just a few minutes because this five minutes candle so this 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. In less than 30 minutes, we have met our TP. Which one is to 3, right? So but 1 is to 2 is the recommended one, the minimum you can go for. Okay, so we'll get it like this. I think this is enough. The video is getting too long already. So you've seen, I believe you understood the um, teachings very well. So this is just how you do it. 
I can continue backtesting until we reach our um TB. Meanwhile, we have um you can see here that price is retracing. Price is already retracing from a 15 minutes time frame. You can see this is where um price is retracing from here. Price is giving us this retracement, and then you can see it's still coming down, it's still coming down. So if we go down to Maybe you see this kind of scenario. What you do is go down to your five minutes time frame. As you go down to your five minutes time frame, you are waiting. But look at this now. Look at this. This one has not given us the um. It has not given us the signal, the entry signal, right? And then this one here has not also given us the entry signal. It's still selling, like like it's still dropping. And this is this is retracement and we don't want to take any sell trade here remember this guys please remember this we don't want to take any sell trade we want to take buy trades in so what do we want to see we want to see this um indicator move like this and do something like this right at this point it's crossing over so we are going to see this um so we are going to see this up to this point we want to see it's giving us this kind of cross then we want to see this one come down like this and then about to turn then the um maybe you want to see something like this let's see something like this All right and then maybe start giving us something like this something like this and then we want to see the moving average here come up to this point and then give us something like this a signal like a cross and then that's where we buy with a target that's where we buy with a target of one is to five i mean one is to two risk reward ratio as minimum you can target higher like i always say you can target higher but minimum should be one is to two minimum should be one is to two guys something like this and then minimum should be one is to two or if you are targeting the high like this, at least you can go with one is to three. Because most of the times I like to target the high like this. If I'm thinking I like to target the high. Right? So it can be more than one is to two, but minimum should be one is to two. Alright. Once this whole um once this whole um conditions have been met, you take your trade. The condition that should be met, like I said earlier, should be that. You see this moving average um sorry you see this stochastic rsi give you something like this and then almost crossing then at this point where it is crossing here that's your first signal then secondly you want to see that this moving average comes to this point and then gives you a kind of cross right that is a kind of cross at this point so if you see that at this point then you are free to take your trade and target your minimum of one is to two this will ratio and above right and then believe me you're gonna hit your big profit if you follow this rule this strategy is going to give you almost 100 percent um um accuracy all right so that just it that's how it works i'm sorry this is almost um 23 minutes wow this is too long so I'm going to give you the settings right now. The settings for um, the moving average is this. Look at it. So you are going to have the length MA as 12. I'm going to have the length as 12. And then you are going to have the length EMA as 20. Right? Then you are going to go over to your style. You are going to keep them at these colors. These are just the... Um, default colors that you see that's it then untick this one here remove it untick this one also normally they will be ticked like this like this but untick them right that's it and then make sure everything is like this then click done that's okay you are good to go then the next one is the stochastic rsi the setting is like this also Come to the input, set it this way as you can see on mine. On 
my own so set it like this just like this then go to style and also set it like this okay so we don't need this key period actually we don't need it so you remove it then um label you don't, you don't necessarily need this label so uncheck it this is it okay and then click okay this is it is done you are good to go so you have your setup ready so with this you can now begin to trade and make money which is so thank you guys if you got value from this video please like and subscribe smash the like button okay also turn on the post notification bell so whenever i drop a new post like this you get notified thank you guys for watching this is the alpha trade and as always we are telling you that it can only get better goodbye